In this video, we're going to see how to sign our Android application using codemagic.yaml. If you're using the workflow editor, then you can check out our other video. If you don't already have a key store for your application, please check out our official documentation for doing that. To sign our Android application, we have two ways. The first way is the code signing identities, which we're going to explain in this video. The other way is using environment variables, which we explained in the previous video. Let's open our Android key stores at code signing identities section and upload our key store or JKS file. Now you need to enter your key store password, key alias, and key password. And last but not least, the reference name, which is a unique name used to reference the file in codemagic.yaml. Click on Add Key Store. Now in the Available Key Store section, you can see all of your keys with some basics information. You can copy the reference name as well. Now let's use that key in our codemagic.yaml file. In our Environment section, we can import our key by its reference name we copied. What this would do is export the key store credentials as environment variables. That's it for the code signing identities. Now depends on your pill.gradle configuration if you configured it to read and get the signing info from the environment variables then you're good to go or if you're reading from a key.properties file then you need to add this script that will create this file using the variables that have been exported using the code signing identities. Check the docs for more information.